hello friends this is the inside video of b3 compact charger in the previous video i have unboxed this b3 compact charger and showed you how to use this b3 compact charger for 2s and 3s lipo battery pack and in this video we will see what we have in this b3 compact charger I had already opened this box and let's see what we have in this circuit. The quality of this circuit is very good. It looks like the company doesn't want to show their IC name. So when this charger will get damaged or this IC will get burned, you can't install the another IC here. There are not much components on the upper side of this PCB but uh, but there are more components below the circuit here we have a small transformer just like an ordinary mobile charger they are separate three types of capacitor for each cell and here is a register it's a it's a few register so when uh, there is a high voltage this uh, register will get blown for the safety of this circuit and uh, the J8 pin IC and uh, its name is not here so when this uh, IC will get blown so you can't replace this IC and on the back side we can see a power isolation and optocoupler of uh, 817 is given here so it's safe that uh, whenever there is a short circuit and uh, any problem here there is no risk of high voltage in the output this uh, 817 optocoupler IC prevents the connection from high voltage from this primary side to secondary side of this transformer and on the second side we can see the transformer pins there are four pins in the transformer in the primary side and there are one two three four five six six pins in the secondary side and one pin is not for use therefore there are only three pins mainly and the two pins are mainly short so therefore there is only usable two pins here and on the second side uh, there are six pins it has six pins that means for each cell it has separate power supply and uh, separate IC is here and uh, we can see the IC number <coughs> more clearly that uh, let me revert the circuit the IC number is given uh, 5056 so here is TP4056 module of uh, 3.7 volt batteries and the components looks almost similar to these components that means it has three TP4056 module so we can make uh, this type of BMS charger but we have to use separate power supply that means uh, this transformer is giving three different power supply for each cells two pins for this IC and two pins for this IC and two pins for this IC so if we want to make this type of BMS charger circuit then we have to use uh, three different power supply for each cells so this how it works so if we use a transformer that gives three different power supply for each cells then we can connect this type of TP4056 module and we can make this type of chargers because uh, the cost of this charger i have got this at uh, 450 but if we can make this charger it will cost you more or less the cost of this tp4056 module is almost almost 30 rupees so so we need three type of this modules and a transformer that will give you three different power supply so in my future videos i will try to make this type of BMS battery management charger B3 compact charger with my own circuit 
so stay tuned with my channel i will make this type of 2s and 3s charger at low cost so that you can make it at your home without any more cost of paying 450 rupees and wasting money because uh, this charger is good at this price but uh, when it will get blown up you can't repair anymore because this ic has no number printed on it so i will try to make this with my own circuit so stay tuned with my channel and uh, thanks for watching and please subscribe our channel for next upcoming videos